नमस्कार हेलो एंड वेलकम टू चाय चैट विद लवीना इट्स न्यू ईयर्स एंड आई एम स्टैंडिंग हियर आउटसाइड द वाइकिंग कम्युनिटी सेंटर न्यू ईयर्स मीन्स न्यू होप्स नई उम्मीद कोई भी नई चीज़ नई उम्मीद लाती है और ये नई उम्मीद हमें यहाँ दिखी लोगों में सिंपल पीपल डूइंग बिग थिंग्स उम्मीद जहाँ लोगों के मन में ख़त्म हो गई in this new years along this christmas in this winter people have had not been able to heat their houses or eat proper food and when apart from the government who may or may not be able to do a lot individuals are coming forth and helping small charities are coming forth and helping and i'm on this chai chat going to talk to such people ye hai hamari ummeed the new hope so come on let's go and chat to them and by the end of it you'll see why these small things go a big big way bank that also serves as a warm space this is a new scheme that the government or the council some of the councils have been running in the wake of the kind of energy crisis that the uk is facing where people are finding it hard to heat their homes and everything is gone expensive you turn your head and it's gone expensive so i'm going to speak to these volunteers and people who have been uh, small charities and individual people who have come together and are doing this uh, everyone is making an effort but then uh, people even individual charities have had to pitch in and i want to figure out why this is happening and why uh, there's not been enough uh, grant or support or whatever it is what is the need so i'm here with raju thank you she's worked very hard to to pull all of this together <laughs> thank you thank you raju ji please tell me uh, ki is tarah ki um, गवर्नमेंट कहाँ लैक कर रही है और आपको कहाँ एक इंडिविजुअल चैरिटी है इस तरह से अपनी जर्नी भी बताइए और उसके साथ शायद इस सवाल का हमें आंसर भी मिल जाएगा ये शुरू हुआ 2000 में जब ये लॉकडाउन हुआ था हाँ। जब ये लॉकडाउन टू थाउजेंड नहीं ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी में था ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी में हाँ। तो लॉकडाउन जब ही हुआ तो हम उधर जा रहे थे फूड बैंक में हाँ। तो साउथ होल में ये लोग ने फूड बैंक खोला था हम उधर हेल्प कर रहे थे जैसे जैसे हम हेल्प कर रहे थे उधर बहुत डिफिकल्ट होना शुरू हो रहा था स्लोली बट श्योरली तो ये लोग ने जैसे ही शटडाउन खत्म हो गया ये लोग ने स्ट्रेट वे बंद कर दिए लेकिन अभी सारे जैसे प्राइजेज ऊपर जा रहे ये प्रॉब्लम हो रही है पैसे नहीं है गवर्नमेंट किसी की बॉर्डर नहीं कर रही है अपने लिए रख रहे हैं दे नॉट हेल्पिंग द पुअर पीपल आउट देर वो लोग को बहुत ज़रूरत है फिर मैं रागिनी हम बैठे हम दोनों ने बैठकर बात की कि अभी हम क्या करें कैसे हेल्प करें हम खुद नहीं जानते कि हम कैसे करें हम इधर आए ये लोग ने बोला ठीक है आप लोग फ्री हॉल ले लो हॉल तो हमें अभी फ्री मिल गया कोई तो हेल्प करने वाला नहीं है गवर्नमेंट नहीं कर रही है हमारी हेल्प तो मैंने पूछा अभी हम क्या करें तो हमने एनिका के साथ बात की एनिका एक बहुत छोटी लड़की है जो खुद अभी स्टडी भी करती थी काम भी करती है तो शी डिसाइडेड कि चलो मैं ये लोग की हेल्प करती हूँ ऐसे उसकी खुद की चैरिटी पर उसने हमारी हेल्प करने में इनपुट किया अच्छा तो एवरी फ्राइडे आप यहाँ हाँ। ये हम इस वक्त वाइकिंग कम्युनिटी सेंटर में हैं हर फ्राइडे अगर आप चाहें तो साढ़े नौ से डेढ़ बजे के बीच में हाँ। आ सकते हैं सो वॉट टेल मी अबाउट दिस वॉम स्पेस डबल्स अप एज अ फूड कैम्प योर कम्युनिटी सेंटर Uh, so uh, pe- people from the community are more than welcome to come um, enjoy some um, sometimes we serve refreshments um it's it's a, a space that's welcoming uh, they're here to socialize they can uh, they can bring friends and family and they can also because we we understand the cost of living crisis and this is this is the least we could do hmm. thank you very much ahmed um and uh, i'm going to speak to now kamal who is the volunteer here at the center please tell me what kind of people come what is their situation kya kitni musibat aur kis tarah tarah ke log aate hain idhar log aata hai bahut majburi se aata hai kyunki gas electricity bahut mehanga ho gaya people say ke aur money nahi ke chale gaye shopping kare 
और ज़्यादा पीपल से इधर आता है मुस्लिम पीपल आता है अफगानी पीपल आता है एशियन पीपल आता है मिक्स आता है मगर ज़्यादा पीपल ज़्यादा कंपनियाँ के चार थे कि उसको हाथ है हर्क नहीं करता और बस दो सारी वीक फोर टाइम्स फाइव टाइम्स में डिफरेंट डिफरेंट शॉप छोटा छोटा शॉप स्टाफ ले आता बहुत मुश्किल से पेट्रोल हल्क नहीं होता किसी का हल्क नहीं करता बच्चों से ना कि मेरी मेरी वाइफ रखनी हेल्प करता है कि बोलता है कि पीपल जरूरत पीपल के है पीपल से हेल्प करें थैंक यू वेरी मच रागिनी टेल मी वन थिंग आर देर पीपल हु हैव बीन लिविंग हियर फॉर अ लॉन्ग टाइम ऑल्सो आर नाउ जॉइनिंग और हैव हैड टू कम टू द फूड बैंक Yes, we've had a lot of newcomers mm. as well as um you know our my local community because I literally live in the state myself. Mm. I've been living here for over 8 years. Um I've seen it grow. Mm. There is a lot of there's still a lot of poverty within the community. Um but a lot of them are my neighbors. Mm. So when I told them I was opening up this food hub, they were so excited and mm. they were very saying how proud they were of me. you know doing something like this and reaching out to the most vulnerable um families and children obviously uh, Paul you are one of the volunteers I aren't you yes. so tell me what is different that you have seen as compared to all the other times the food banks have been running for mm. a while and what are the difficulties that you face face here yeah so what, what i've noticed recently is that the people that come into the food bank you know you always have a kind of picture of those mm. who need help but actually the help is getting wider and mm. um, there's more and more people who are affected by the cost of living crisis and mm. um, so i feel that in terms of my volunteering in my time it's just i've seen so many people every single week mm. are coming and they this is their meal this is what they're using to feed their families and um it's not just what we call the poor it's it's the poor level is rising so there's more and more people mm. needing the food bank mm. so anika you yes. are the person here yes. i have even um, you see anika with milo who she is housing and helping uh, anika where where why is there a lack of um help from the government which is why individuals have had to do it and how to, is the extent too much of that individual help required definitely there's been no help from the government whatsoever and i think if they could make grants more affordable and more accessible towards smaller charities mm. that they'd be able to help out a lot more because smaller charities reach a niche of people that large scale charities aren't able to reach mm. especially with ethnic minority groups mm. unfortunately especially in the south asian community mm. there's a lot of stigma surrounding food banks and people coming here so they're not able to access it again due to pressure from the communities so we could have, have more help from the government especially more focus towards smaller charities mm. because they niche they reach mm. larger scale charities can't reach it yes exactly and and think that's where our show today is focused on the smaller group of people who are coming forward and doing this tell me anika how you started and who all and how you're helping and how you're getting help So Anika Food Charity actually started in 2018. Mm. It'll be almost 5 years now next Jan. And we started by again just very small. What we found was that a lot of people especially in the South Asian ethnic minority groups were ashamed to physically visit the food banks. Mm. So what we started doing, we started operating on a delivery basis where we would actually go to the homeless shelters, survivors of domestic violence, visit their personal homes, mm. and it also allowed us to have a good relationship with them where we would give them the food. And now very luckily we have huge charity partners, leading brands such as Greggs, the Morrison's Foundation, Pretaman J, we have Toiletary Zamisti with the Hygiene Bank Ealing. Mm. We also have Hey Girls for sanitary pads. Mm. So we have about 7 8 leading charity partners and that enables us to be able to provide not just food but basic everyday life essentials. So how difficult was it for you to get Morrison's and get these partners? Were they easy no. accessible? It was hard. I think I would say actually four years in 2022 we feel that we're actually fully established it was a lot of constant emails going up to them and saying look no we're here we're helping these um ethnic minorities and people from low socioeconomic areas we can help and provide that reach but it was actually really just building a portfolio and also charity identity for ourselves and i would say it didn't happen overnight it took mm. us about four years to be able to reach that kind of brand recognition that we have now mm 
Okay. So what is it that will help you? How can people help if they want to reach out to you? Donations, give time. It doesn't have to be financial donations. It could be anything that's at home. For example, tinned food. If somebody could help, you know, just provide some cooked meals. Where would they come? Um, they could come here, so North Holt Food Bank. They could volunteer. They could provide donations. They could supply us with cooked food that we can give to people, that we can make parcels. Another thing that they also do is um, emergency parcels for three days, mm. so where you can just give cooked meals and just, um, like, for example, bars of soaps, maybe toothbrushes, that can help at least keep, keep them sustained for three days, like emergency bags. So uh, you don't have to make a financial donation. I think a lot of people think that that's what I have to do, but that's not the case. Even your time, any skill set that you have, it could be admin work, maybe you're good at the computer, you could help with you know, logging people in, logging people out. So any skill set that you have that you can donate, I think that would be the biggest that advantage. That would be great. And, and you will find on, the, on, on our scroll the, uh, the, where, where this community center is being run. So this is the Viking Community Center in North Holt. But there are various hubs across the program. I will be taking you through the various places where you could just reach out to either the local food bank or the Anika Food Charity or come here North Hall to the South Hall. There is various other places. Please find it. I'm here with Milo. And Milo is uh, many, uh, one of many who slip out of the system and therefore find themselves in even difficult uh, circumstances. Tell me, Milo, about you and how you were helped. How was I was helped? I was helped by then. Hmm. By giving me shelter hmm. and eat there, hmm. uh, nice to nice bed. Hmm. Even though it's like box type, but I really ap appreciate it, this one. Hmm. And they give me food and a bit of cash hmm. and times like this. Hmm. Yeah. Do you also use it as a warm space, uh, places like this, um, or, or, or or you find hard to heat your house? It, it is difficult, as I said, like it's difficult for a lot of people. It is a warm space. Um, there's uh, quite a few places out there that you can go to, which are warm spaces like libraries and stuff. Vipula, tell me about the food here, the food bank, or do you think it's better to sit here and why do you need it? Because I can't do it, I can't do it, I can't do it, so these people help me and I'm very happy because their people are very nice and give nice food. Samina, you come here, tell me, you feel like every Friday here, so why do you need it and how long do you need it, tell me. जी इसलिए क्योंकि फूड की प्राइसेस काफी हाई जा रही हैं और एस अ सिंगल मदर एवरीबॉडीज वांट टू सेव सम क्विड्स यू नो बिकॉज़ एस अ सिंगल मदर सो जब मुझे किसी ने बताया कि यहाँ पे फूड बैंक है तो फिर मैं एवरी फ्राइडे कराती हूँ और ये लोग एवरीथिंग होता ब्रेड टीन फूड फ्रेश वेजिटेबल्स फूड � and that's why I know this. It's time for a short break, but when we come back, we have more such heartwarming stories for you, and that, I feel, is hope. So stay tuned on Chai Chat. Mm -hmm.